So, I guess, um, as you can see, the go-kart is finished being painted. I recently finished it up, and, yeah, here, I'll give you kind of an overall view, and then I, it's kind of midway through the assembly, I put the wheels on, just to kind of, so I could roll it out of my little painting area, so I'd be mobile for assembly. So, yeah, you can kind of see that there. Looks pretty good. I did kind of, like, the whole frame, it was, I painted blue, like, kind of all the big parts, and then I painted smaller parts, like, um, the, like, accelerator and brake rod. I don't even know what's, I don't really know what that's called. And the, like, steering assembly, all black. And then the, uh, drum brake and the sprocket hub thing is also black. So, yeah. And then the motor mount, too, so. This little holder thing and this rod, and then this whole steering assembly. It's all black. Yeah. So I'm gonna just add the motor mount. And then sprocket and drum brake, yeah. I, I just kind of cleaned up the wheels too because they were pretty dirty with like this black magic stuff I had laying around this tire wet and it looked pretty alright you know it gives that kind of like looks like the tires are wet which is pretty nice and I mean I think it turned out pretty nice for like such a big job I actually went through like a couple cans of this stuff and yeah, I'll show you the paint I used I like I got some of this stuff this appliance paint this is like really good paint because it, it like really sticks to metal and stuff good so yeah kind of see that it's black and then just this rustoleum plus yeah it's blue and then for the primer I used this stuff it's all out but kind of, yeah some just cheap primer rustoleum well rustoleum's not that bad actually yeah, it's like two times the coverage, so yeah, I thought that was pretty good. And it turned out really nice, I think. And I still need to put the seat on. I've just been kind of cleaning it up. Use some, like, all-purpose cleaner on it. So, yeah, it looks pretty nice. I don't really know what to do about that. Maybe put, like, some black duct tape or something, but it's all right, I guess. Kind of clean that up. Give it a little bit of shine. Yeah, it's the seat. And then... I'm actually, uh, it's the other wheel, I think. Yeah, I'm missing one of the bolts. Somewhere in the garage. I'll have to look for that, but yeah. And the motor, the engine, still needs to be painted. I just haven't really got around because I need some engine enamel paint, or engine enamel paint. Enamel, yeah, there we go. Um, paint, like, stuff that can, like, hold up to the heat. So yeah, I'll have to go get that at a Kragen or something. And yeah, so that should look good and it's done. And then kind of polish up some of the chrome pieces and stuff. And then still need to get an air filter for that. I haven't done that yet. But yeah, looks pretty alright. Oh, and one more thing is this is all this like brake stuff linkage. Yeah, it kind of goes back to the drum. So I need to sand that down and paint that. So, I'm probably going to just do that black, too. Kind of go with the linkage. Yeah, um, I think it turned out pretty alright for, you know, kind of a, such a big job. And, you know, I mean, there are a few runs, but there's nothing really too noticeable. So, yeah, um, that's a little update on the go-kart. And, yeah, I'll make another video once it's fully assembled.